everyone. Tonight, a Hamilton County Sheriff's deputy is out of a job after getting caught meeting what he thought was a 15-year-old girl for sex. Yeah, actually, he was talking with a group of parents who busted him on Facebook Live. Anjanette Levy is here now with that story. Anjanette? Well, Kyle, we want to be very clear. Ryan Parker has not been charged with a crime. Parker worked at the Hamilton County Jail until this morning. He could possibly face charges after being caught up in this sex sting set up by some parents. Got an exposure going on tonight. 32-year-old Ryan meeting our 15-year-old decoy. That's Dale Cook staking out a rendezvous point in Claremont County on Facebook Live. Ryan Parker is a Hamilton County Sheriff's deputy. Cook says Parker believed he was meeting a 15-year-old girl for sex. She's not coming. Who? Oh, what? Yeah, she's not coming, Ryan. What do you mean? Cook and his wife Kelly confronted Parker Thursday night. They started setting up stings on Parents Against Predators nationwide last month. They work with other Facebook groups in other states. A lot of my friends are cops and they're great people. They do a lot. Obviously, I, I just feel that there's not enough resources to monitor the chat sites that we need done. Cook says a few days ago, Parker started chatting with a decoy out of Pennsylvania. He started out, you know, warning me of the, 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 um, the men that are out there that will take advantage of these children. Cook says naked photos and raunchy messages followed. Then Parker set up last day. night's meeting. I mean, I made stupid decisions to send those pictures, but... But you wasn't going to act on it. I wasn't going to act on Come it. Come on, man. Well, Parker admitted that he was a sheriff's deputy. Right now, you're a sexual predator. Okay. Well, I don't, I don't know. I'm not a sexual predator, really. So I, how aren't you? Meanwhile, the cooks have a message for parents. Monitor your children's social media devices. That would basically cut us out if every parent monitored their own children's devices. A couple from Indiana actually set up the Parents Against Predators nationwide Facebook page. They work with other groups in Kentucky, Louisiana, and Pennsylvania, and other groups are already forming. The Cooks said they don't want to be viewed as vigilantes. They say they just want to work with police to help keep the kids safe. Kyle? All right, Angela, thank you so much. Ryan Parker worked for the Sheriff's Office for two years. And again, he has not been charged with a crime. The video and the chat logs, though, have been turned over to the sheriff's office, and we're told the sheriff is investigating.